It's the last edition of Metrofile for the month of June and we're gradually winding down half of the year 2021. Wow. Anyway, I hope we achieve all we plan to achieve by the end of this year. Happy weekend to you all and welcome to our social diary program, Metrofile, right here on Channels Television. Don't forget, watch out for flash photography while you enjoy today's edition. I'm Anne Mwawudu. After days of activities to mark the first anniversary of the coronation of Oniru of Iriland, Oba Abdulwasiu or Mobola Honlawal, a gala topped it all to mark his reign so far. And of course, dignitaries from all walks of life came together to celebrate with him. Take a look. Long beehive of activities mark in the first year coronation anniversary of the Oniru of Iruland, Oba Abdul Wasiu Omogbolahon Lawal, came to a climax with a gala attended by leaders from far and near. Traditional rulers and other dignitaries, including the Vice President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, Professor Yemio Shibaju, and the Ikiti State Governor, Dr. Kayode Fayemi, attended the event. The Oniru, as you know, is uh, someone who is, has been for very many years, not just a personal friend, but a brother. We were, of course, as you know, in the Lagos State uh, at various times, and of course, you know, he was in the Lagos State Cabinet as well. But he's somebody who I have uh, the, a great deal of uh, respect for, and I know that the future of this community is very bright with an Oniru like himself. Not just being thoroughly educated, but also a visionary individual, someone who sees the future and is ready to ensure that he brings that future to pass uh, in a very, very short time. Then other traditional rulers and guests join the dinner dance. The 15th Oniru of Iruland, His Royal Majesty Oba Abdul Wasiu Omogbola Honlawal Abisogun II was born on July the 24th, 
1970. He was elevated to become the 15th monarch to rule Iruland on the 7th of June 2020 after the death of Obaidou Oniru. Before Obalawal's enthronement, he was the Commissioner for Agriculture in Lagos State. Obalawal attended Holy Trinity Primary School Ibutero from 1976 to 1982 and St. Gregory's College Obalinde from 1982 to 1987. He studied botany at the University of Port Hackett, River State from September 1988 to September 1992. He then proceeded to the United Kingdom where he studied for his MSc in Violence, Conflict and Development at the School of Oriental and African Studies, University of London and MSc at the London School of Economics and Political Science. He also took a certificate course on jobs for a globalizing world at the World Bank Institute in April 2010. Obalawal also took part in several programs from several institutions, including the Kennedy School of Government at the Harvard University, European Center of Advanced and Professional Studies in Cambridge, and the Wharton School at the University of Pennsylvania. He enlisted in the Nigerian Police Force in August 1996 and was commissioned as Assistant Superintendent of Police by the Nigeria Police Academy. In October 2008, he retired as Superintendent of Police. In June 1999, he was appointed aide-de-camp under Governor Bola Tinumbu and served until 2007, when he was appointed Senior Special Assistant Special Projects to the Lagos State Governor Babatunde Fashola from December 2008 to July 2011. He was reappointed into the cabinet of Governor Fashola in July 2011 as the Commissioner for Agriculture and Cooperatives. He also served in Governor Akiwumi Ambodi's administration as the Commissioner for Housing, who was the Commissioner Lagos State Minister of Agriculture under the government of Babajide Sonwolu from August 2019 until his enthronement in June 2020. We want to ensure that our intervention in the spatial planning is, uh, is, uh, is global in approach because this community, this kingdom is the corporate headquarters of Nigeria. So in any form of intervention that we're going to come up with must be sustainable. We have the Atlantic Ocean. We must find a way of sustaining the, 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 the Atlantic Ocean. We must ensure that the life below the water, that is SDG 14, and the life on the water, on the on land. And uh, essentially, I've, I've, I'm grateful to Almighty God. I'm grateful to the good people of the kingdom, sons and daughters. They have really supported me, and I'm happy, I'm glad that it's three, over 365 days, precisely 300 and... 72 days today. So, and I'm the last time.
He is wishing His Royal Highness many successful years of reign over Iru Kingdom. <laughs> him all the best and more years on the throne.